guys, it's Kara here. I'm back with another video. This time, I'm excited to show you guys the Samsung Norris Digital Pencil. Um, I actually took it out already. It's in my pencil case. It's a realistic looking pencil that works with the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 and a list of other devices. So this is going to be my very first impression of it. I'm so excited to try this. I've been waiting for this for weeks, guys. First, they lost my order the first time. The second time, it came broken. Here's a picture right here. And now I finally have it. And let's just get right onto it. So this is looks like a regular normal pencil. I don't have a regular. This is a mechanical pencil from the dollar store. But as you can see, next to a real pen it looks real uh this is a very first impression video so i'm just gonna be showing you guys me drawing on it on my note 9 i'll have a more in-depth review coming up soon so guys let's just get started so to get started i just take the cap and put it towards the end and for it to work with the note all i have to do is take out my s pen and put it to the side Sorry there, buddy. And boom, it just automatically works. And we're going to try drawing on Autodesk Sketchbook, my favorite app. So it's just going to be a quick little speed paint. I just wanted to have this intro here, guys, and showing you the box. It says tradition makes innovation. And, and after that, there's just a quick start guide. And it's compatible with a whole bunch of other devices but again I'll cover that in my full review and let's just get started switch to speed painting mode all right guys we're in speed painting mode I decided to do a voiceover for the second half because it was a lot faster because if I did this in real time this video would have been two hours long so right off the bat the pencil feels amazing in the hand compared to the S pen the tip is a lot harder like the nib is a lot harder compared to the s pen which is a little bit more soft which i like a lot better and since the samsung norris digital pencil oh man that's a mouthful to say um it's based off real pencil so it's made out of wood and it looks like a regular statedler drawing pencil and it feels the same and it really improved it really shines through when you're drawing for long hours like that was my biggest drawback for the note um the s pen after a long time doesn't isn't as comfortable compared to the apple pencil the wacom cintiq pencil and stuff like that but i really did enjoy this and for 40 dollars 39.99 well basically 40 dollars on amazon this was an amazing deal and also this is compatible with much more than just the note 9 and it will also be compatible with the note 10 so i can't wait to try this on more devices because uh this is my so far my favorite stylus it's super accurate the parallax there's zero parallax just like there is on the s pen but this one is more comfortable it's like they just took the nibs and then just they just put it in a more comfortable body it's not super thick like um the apple pencil that uh i'm used to it just feels like there's no learning curve with this there's no buttons um there's no eraser which uh actually didn't bother me at all since it looked like one of those uh shading sets of pencils that you get from Satedler. i used to have a set of them so hey man it was really amazing <laughs> drawing on this and it's funny because uh i'm just happy that we're in the age of technology where like we could use a regular pencil that has all these different tools i just felt so happy using it because it's the regular yellow number two pencils or the drawing pencils that we artists grew up with and now it's brought over into the digital realm and it could do so much more we have so much tools in our arsenal and another thing um that i love about the norris digital pencil is that the tilt functionality works really good and since it's long i could tilt my pen um on sideways and i could cover a lot of area like the sensitivity works so great and also there's no barriers to this all i have to do is take out my s pen and it just works i don't have to connect it there's no bluetooth function there's no me calibrating my pen like it just works out of the box and i'm just wow like this was worth the $40 and it's gonna make drawing on my note even more enjoyable now to the cons 
the cons is that drawing on this with my note means that I have to take out my S Pen and I wish there was a better way for this because that means there, it's a lot easier for me to lose my S Pen. It's something small but it's something that I could easily lose so that's one of the biggest downside for me to use this. I have to take out my S Pen and what if I leave it somewhere because I still need my S Pen but technically with this I don't but yeah that's that's just some of the drawbacks for me it's just something very small and minor but yeah guys so about the drawing um the girl that i'm drawing and uh, she's this cosplayer on instagram her ig name is i am soon i'll link her down below you guys could check her out i love this cosplay that she did of an another artist oc called koi doodles um i like the artist also down below that she's cosplaying her art i didn't know it's just i just thought she looked really good in that picture and her makeup was on fleek so that was my focus uh with this drawing i really focused on the makeup the face that's why i didn't really draw the rest of her accessories on the character i just really focused on adding shadows to her cheeks and the, um and doing her eyebrows really good and highlights and also i drew this from an angle guys so um the whole face kind of is like shifted i i need to remember to adjust my camera each time because it affected the drawing but otherwise this was the most comfortable illustration that i've done on my note and i think it's by far my best coloring one by far and i don't know if that has anything to do with the tools but I think it's a combination of the new tools being comfortable again like i said constantly in my tutorials is being comfortable with your art tools like i wasn't fighting with my tools like my hands didn't feel strained after a while i was really excited about this i could get a variety of angles uh, which made it a lot more streamlined to make great work so let me know down in the comments below what do you guys think um for those of you guys that have seen my other speed paint what do you guys think of the quality on this one i really was able to take my time and this took about um roughly an hour and 30 minutes because since i just did a portrait all i focused heavily on was coloring the skin in the hair that's mainly it i didn't do any special shading for the eyes i kind of just left it as it is but yeah guys i really enjoy this a lot more than i thought i would i thought i would be missing like the buttons that i'm usually familiar with on the wacom pencil where i have a left click and a right click where i could like color pick and stuff and i thought i would miss the eraser but this has been the most natural feeling on digital drawing that i ever use and now i think i'm going to recommend this combo for anyone since this pencil is compatible with over the list of devices were endless so i can't wait to try that out and also if you guys are interested in getting this pencil um i have an affiliate link down below meaning that i get a small commission if you guys use that link so uh it would really help out my channel um i'm trying to get um other samsung tablets um that's compatible with this pencil and comparing it to my ipad setup and then comparing it to my cintiq uh my goal on this channel now has become since there's so much out there right now for digital arts compared to <laughs> two four years ago there's a lot more options um a lot more bangs for your buck so the note might work for you the ipad might be a better ecosystem for you or maybe you might realize the cintiq might work better for you so my goal is to cover all of that and give you guys um input and and because there's just so many options now like wacom is no longer king of the game even though this pencil is powered by wacom technology so it also works with the surface pro um pro first gen and the second gen so that's an also another thing so guys i'm just really excited on how far we went and how these things are getting more affordable this works on all the notes till the note three so note three four five eight nine and the 10 will work with it and it's only 40 bucks so yes guys um all my links down below are affiliate links so if you do use them it really helps out this channel for me to get more tech to review for you guys and this was my first impression more detail review coming up comparisons and a lot more others so keep in notification guys and i'll catch you guys in my next one bye